Welcome to the Band of the Month, Layton. Uh, you're going to be part of the Zones Band of the Month for the month of July. How are you feeling about that? Pretty good. Yeah, I'm very excited. <laughs> cool. We were talking earlier during the photo shoot that you wrote the record quite a while ago and, and have sort of been sitting on it throughout COVID and you, you released it a couple months ago. Can you speak to how it is to like sort of sit on some music that you you created so so long ago and and what it's like to not showcase that creativity for for so long and and now that it's out there in the world have you moved past it have you moved past the that that's those songs and are working on new stuff yeah uh, we actually started recording the record itself three years ago which seems crazy um, it's definitely been an interesting time with the pandemic, trying to figure out with, you know, the label and all of the logistics of how to release it, because obviously there's no shows. Um, so we ended up sitting on it for a year, which is, you know, at times frustrating, but I think in the grand scheme, we understood that, like, it was better to wait. Um, and by the time we got around to releasing it, it felt very rewarding. <laughs> So your body is facing mostly this way, uh, right leg In the sweet summertime, I'll get to see by the world. Great. Tell me about the single. Yeah, the, the name is When a Love's Not Around. It's just kind of an ode to all my friends who uh, have been there for me when I have been lonely yeah. and yeah it's just a cute little song appreciating the folks my early 20s I just kind of fell in love with both kind of older psychedelia and more modern um, and you know bands you know off the top of my head like Morgan Delt, Tame Impala, um, Sam Evian like those newer bands and and then moving back to like Pink Floyd even some of Neil Young's stuff like those those have always had like the biggest impact on my music um, so I think it just naturally seeped its way into my music.